Hello guys. So it is now 4.30 where I'm at. Um, I, um, last time I talked to you guys, I told you that, um, my baby had like the isolated finding on her, um, part of the, um, the calcium spot. So I went to the doctor earlier this week and, um, we're doing a, um, I think it's called Natura. It's like the milk test or whatever. It's more like a more um, extensive test or whatever. So I opted to get this and I just have to register this, my kid or whatever. And they said allow 72 hours. So um, I'm supposed to allow um, 72 hours, I guess, for the kit to reach from Arkansas to um, the testing center. So tomorrow I'll, um, well, the blood sample to reach to wherever they're shipping it to. But anyways, um, I will activate it tomorrow because that'll be 72 hours. And I mean, it could already be there, but I'll just wait till tomorrow probably to activate it. Who knows? I might get impatient and try to do it today. But um, the results should be in and um seven days and i can just um go online and look at the results i won't have to wait for my doctor to call me or anything like that so i will update you guys when the results are in all right guys so it is 803 i'm just now making it home from a long drawn out trip we really just went three hours well three and a half hours away for no reason because when we got there there were no hotels me i wasn't thinking that everything would be booked but i forgot that it's spring break weekend so we just turned around and came back and of course i had to make that up to my kids because they went that long ass way for nothing so i just booked a hotel here and that way they'll get to um swim and everything tomorrow but um, I'm going to go ahead and activate the kit. Well, register the kit, whatever I'm supposed to be doing. And um, it should be, the results should be ready in like four to five more days. Hello, everybody. So I'm back today and I'm, um, pleased to tell you guys that I got my um genetic screening results in the NIPT or I might be saying it backwards but those results came in about I got an email about um 2 30 this morning and um it said that my results were in and I obviously wasn't up at 2 30 this morning so I didn't actually get the email until after I Dropped my kids off at school and came home and had already ate breakfast and everything. So, yeah, those are in. Um, and I'm going to try to insert a picture of the results so that you guys can see them for yourself. So, um, yeah, I'm going to try to insert the clip so you guys can see them for yourself and everything. Excuse me. I'm going to take my prenatals this morning. But, yeah, um... I know I'm not going to say this right, but Trey saw me 13 or 18, something like that. But basically, um, she has a 1 in a 10,000 chance, which is like very, 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 very low chance of um, getting any of these um, genetic um, syndromes or disabilities or whatever that is. Um, she is very low risk for it. So that is great. Thank God for that. Um, I'm very, very happy about that. And, um, 
the genetic test did um, show that she is in fact a female. So the ultrasound confirmed she's a female. I had three ultrasounds already that confirmed she's a female and plus the blood test confirmed that she's a female. So very happy about that. But um, yeah, I just wanted to get on here and share that with you guys right quick. Um, so the the calcium spot that they found on her heart, it was a um, isolated finding. I can't think this morning, but um, yeah, it was a, it was an isolated finding, so it's not connected to um, Down syndrome, obviously, because all her tests came back normal, perfectly fine, healthy. So I don't have to worry about that. So thank God for that. Um, now all I have to do is just enjoy the last three and a half months of my pregnancy and I can't wait for July to get here so I can enjoy my baby girl and spoil her and kiss her. If she's anything like her big sister, she's going to be fat and chunky and I can't wait to just smell under her neck and kiss her cheeks and just spoil her. So yeah, if you ever watch this in the future, I can't wait to meet you. So I couldn't wait to meet you, so, yeah, well, meet you, so, yeah, well, I'm not gonna keep rambling, um, hope you guys enjoy the video, please like, share, and subscribe, support your girl, see you guys later.